What do you do when you lose your awareness of God's presence in your life? In other words, maybe you're home or you're at work or you're in your car or you're somewhere and you just don't feel the presence of God. God seems to be a million miles away. And when that happens, it's probably happened to all of us, we feel isolated and we feel very lonely. And so the question I'm asking is, what do we do when we don't sense the presence of God in our lives or when we don't feel the presence of God in our lives? And I have an answer for that question from the Bible. Here's what you do. You claim his presence by faith. You claim his presence by faith. I, I was praying, this has been a little some time back now, one day I had kind of lost my awareness of God's presence. I mean, I know God's with me, but I, I wasn't feeling God's presence on a particular day. And I just said, God, and I thought it was a good prayer. I said, God, I ask, and, it, and it's not a bad prayer. It, it probably is a good prayer. I said, God, I ask you to give me an awareness of your presence with me right now. And I felt, as soon as I said that, I felt the Spirit of God speak to my heart and say, John, you don't need to pray for an awareness of my presence. You need to claim it by faith. And I thought about that. I don't need to pray for it. I need to claim it by faith. What was God saying to me? God was saying, John, you don't need to pray for something that you already have, that is my presence, and, and that you can access and experience and enjoy by faith. And so that made sense to me. And I said, Lord, as soon as, I, as, soon as he spoke that to my heart, I said, Lord, that is true. I don't need to pray for something I already have. I have your presence. The way to have an awareness of it is not by begging for an awareness of it. The way to have an awareness of your presence is to claim it by faith. And I said, so God, by an act of faith right now, I declare to you that I believe that you are right here with me at this moment. I was home when I prayed that I believe you're right here with me in this house. And you know what happened when I did that? I had an awareness of God's presence. I mean, as soon as I prayed that, I had what I was seeking. I had an awareness of God's presence. How did I get it? Not by praying for it, but by claiming it by faith. And so today, maybe you're in a season like that and you say, you know what? I just don't feel God. I, I don't sense God's presence. Well, you know, sometimes God will remove from us, not his presence. He'll never remove his presence from us, but he will remove from us our awareness of his presence or, or our feeling of his presence so that he can wean us off of those feelings that many times we become dependent on. We're like, I know God is with me if I feel God. Well, when God looks down and sees that, he says, I've got to wean them off their feelings because you can't live by feelings. Feelings change. I've got to teach my child that they trust me, whether they feel me, sense me, or have an awareness of my presence or not. They just have to take it by faith. And so today, I encourage you to say this to God. Say, God, by faith, I declare that you are right here with me because you promised that you would always be with me. I don't feel your presence. I don't sense your presence. But God, I, I, I claim your presence by faith. And I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. When you claim his presence, you're going to become aware of his presence. Now, that doesn't mean you're going to feel anything. You might or you might not. You can't live by feelings. Feelings change. And God, God has to wean us off of those, those feelings. But uh, just tell God today that you claim his presence by faith. And I'll guarantee you, as the day goes on, you're going to have what you're looking for. You're going to have that awareness of his presence. Because faith is how we live the Christian life from the beginning when we got saved until the very end when we step out into eternity to see Jesus face to face. Claim his presence today by faith and uh, enjoy your day with God. Have a good one.